Hello everyone, welcome to the channel and in today's video we're gonna showcase Mr. Tony Stark and Iron Man tier 4 with his old uniform, the superior Iron Man and the new uniform. In what content? In every content he could participate and as it seems he is meta for like 3 out of 4 basic, uh, you know, content of basically uh, on every content of PvE, I'm not testing him for PvP at all, I'm testing him only for PvE and I'm talking about 3 days of ABX, as it seems he's meta for all 3 days he could participate Villain Blast Mail, Villain, uh, uh, how it's called, Blast Mail, at Hero or whatever and the free day, yes, you listen well, he's doing like the same for my account, pretty similar damage with the best one, Loki. So if you have him and you don't have Loki, you could go through Iron Man for this day also. So we're talking about 3 days of ABX, we're talking about 3 World Boss Legend, we're talking about GBR without having an advantage and you know, Blast versus Blast. And you can compare him with the other days, gonna be like a couple of minutes less, couple of minutes more you have to adjust it yourself squad battle free day and what else yes i'm not forgetting anything and of course you should already know he's really cool for the auto clear stuff the spots and stuff but i couldn't record for that uh some videos uh, and i just did for you know i just did the ones that you have to play manually so before we go through and show you the build and how I was using him while I was having him in my team up, uh, I want you to make me a favor, to do me a favor and subscribe to the channel, like, press the like button and comment something you want uh, extra you want me to showcase about Iron Man. If you are not 100% sure about building him dropping down below in the comments and help me to you know push the algorithm of youtube and my videos getting more views in general so after that let's go through uh, the build he is capped on pretty much everything he got uh, really oh i'm getting a power or something yes i was getting something i had more yes my energy attack it's eight thousand one. Th it's 81,000, not 85 as before, and I don't have ignored the dots. I saw the ignored dots, that's why I understand it. And my build pretty much it's full stacked up Odin's Blessing, except here one. I'm missing a magic Odin Blessing and I'm waiting for it. His gears, it's super duper cool. And about the strike skill, I'm gonna tell you after, uh, you know, before we start the showcase for ABX first. Uh, his type advancement is full, stage 12 power Hunger Hulk. I got his artifact, but I don't have the right, uh, no proc. I should have like damage against pure level or critical rate or critical damage. This one is the best. And here I'm rocking a CTP of raids. That's what, how I did everything I did. And for this uniform, it's everything full, but I'm missing the two, these two. So he's getting even better if you build him even more. And here you can see I have everything for the superior, the villain uniform one. Uh, so before we go through, I want you to advise you about uh, this thing here, you know. Uh, Iron Man, perhaps with his new uniform, got the fire and the silence and, the, and his missing paralysis. So you can come here, I'm not 100% about missing paralysis, I have to check it, but you can see here, you're choosing characters for the striking ability with the same, you know, tag, if you find with the same tag is better because you're getting more buff out of here, but even if it's not with the, the right one stat, you know, justice, the right one, one instinct, you want to play with that and equip a character like this one. I used Wanda in one of ABX uh, showcases as a striker, the one that uh, he is super villain, uh, you know, bl um, uh, blast super villain, because with this way you can use her force skill and silence the enemy. Uh, perhaps you're gonna find yourself other characters got in the, their force skill a silence ability, so you can run through and put this one. You're getting less buff here, 
but guys it's 20% less buff and you're able not to swap and just do the silence every single time with your 7th skill, your tier 4 skill. So it's so broken, I did it myself and I was like, okay, this is an option. But in general, for the damages in the videos, I'm using Jane Foster because I feel like she's doing a lot of damage. So let's start with the gameplay of uh, ABX and go through the other. So let's start with the Blast Villain Day and with the Superior Iron Man uniform. And you can see I'm using Wanda, as I told you. Uh, his rotation it's kind of uh, weird because you need to pass the buff from the 5th skill into his 6th skill or into his 4th skill. So sometimes I was having trouble doing it, but still you can see I'm already 1.3 million and uh, the, you know we are all in the first seconds of the fight. And it's the blast villain day that I used to use Mephisto here. Uh, Mephisto with a mighty judgment was able to pull out maximum 9.3 for my account. I played like 10 times or uh, you know and I was like 9.1, 9.2, 9.3. Even if I was doing perfect rotations with my Mephisto I couldn't do more as uh, with the build I got. And it's pretty similar with Iron Man's you know. And here you can see, I'm able to silence with my Wanda. Ooh, cheats, cheats. <laughs> it's kind of, you know, silencing with a character that he's not able to silence feels like cheating, you know? And yes, here you want to wait a bit having your other skills before you use the bubble from the fourth skill. So you're gonna be able to take advantage of the accumulation and the damage proc on it. It's kind of, you know, you need to wait, you need to run, there is a lot of stuff you need to do, uh, but the damage is there, guys. And uh, be before, you know, for people that watching the skills press, get pressed and wondering why sometimes I'm using my fourth skill at the end, it's because your fourth skill, guys, doesn't really interrupt your skills. So even if you use your tier 3 and right after you use your 4th skill, your tier 3 gonna display until the end. There's a, you know, you're not cancelling skills using the 4th skill, uh, the 7th the skill. The 7th skill, it's just the skill that you're getting buffed and nothing else. You're not getting like, uh, you know, you're not getting interrupt or something. You could do whatever you were doing and and you got extra the fourth skill. Sometimes I'm not doing that and I'm trying to press it in between the skills, but there is no point doing it. You could use it in the end of the skills. You could use it in the start. It's pretty much the same. Here I missed one proc with it. You know, the, ru the runs, it's pretty sloppy. I, I did record it just for the just for the showcase of tier 4, you know, uh, I could play even more and having more time, but it was the best, I have him like 2 days and I was playing everything he was able to and on every single game mode I was playing, I was like, what? 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 He can do that? What? And you can see, I did this sloppy run here and I was able to to, ru to run 9.05 it's almost 9.1 which I'm able to do with my Mephisto with a mighty judgment and full stacked on Odin's blessing also now let's check him into the blast mail day uh, where you have to use uh, you know only blast types and I'm using Cyclops here uh, I have an advantage of Cyclops, uh, you know, I, I already used the Cyclops in the previous video and he got a CTP of Insight. On the video I'm going to showcase you in the free day, I'm using Nick Fury as the leadership, but he don't have any Insight. So from the score you're gonna see now and the score you're gonna see without, uh, without Cyclops and in his position, uh, uh, Nicholas Fury, you're gonna see, you know, uh, you, you have to add like 200k or 500k or something like that. Because with an inside proc, you could score even more. But that's for the next, uh, for the next uh, showcase. You see there, I'm doing a weird rotation. 
it's not weird rotation guys it's the abx rotation of fireman in the abx rotation you want him to uh, you want to take advantage of your third skill and not canceling it uh, you look at me i'm doing the third skill wait here and having my other skills dropping my fifth skill using my tier three right after and after i'm filling up the empty space with the t the third skill every single time you want to utilize it you're starting the rotation with something like two cancel four cancel five you're letting the fifth skill place until the end and you are going through your third skill you're letting your third skill until your fourth skill is off cooldown and again two cancel four cancel five and when you have ready your tier three you're canceling your third skill and using it uh, you know, it's it's the same the same logic. When you're having other skills, you're canceling your third skill. If you don't have other skills, you're pressing your third skill and you're filling up the empty space of doing damage all the time. Because that's the point in ABX. You need to push it, push it, push it and don't stop. That's why CTP of Rage is the best for it. Most of the times, basically 99% of the times it's better than mighty judgments mighty destructions even if it's not crafted ctp you know because it, it's giving you the opportunity to have uh, reduced uh, armor but for a um, bigger bigger time like five seconds every single time you can see here i'm filling with the third skill and here i'm using jane as i told you i'm using here because i like here also and yeah yeah, this Iron Man can silence himself with his first skill. Uh, the other Iron Man couldn't, si couldn't silence. That's why I was using Wanda, even if I was losing some of my proc on the seventh skill. Uh, but you can see here, he's doing great damage for Blast Mail. I was having trouble doing more than 10 million with my Doctor Strange and with Mephisto. I had like uh, 9.7, uh, 10 million max. And I'm already here, as you can see, 11 million. 11 million with this boy here. And you see me there. I could slap some other Sodin's Blessings. So let's go to the next one. Okay, in this one, it's pretty similar. I mean, I'm using pretty much the same setup, but you can see better now the rotation. 2, cancel 4, cancel 5. Filling with the third skill. 2, cancel 1, cancel 4, tier 4, 5th skill. Every single time you're using your tier 4, you're not canceling the skills. That's the big deal, guys. That's the big deal. You can use it as a buff. It's like enabling a CTP with, uh, with just a button without waiting the proc, you know? It's like having a button that you're boosting your character. Turbo or Nitro button, like cars, you know? So, yeah, it's pretty nice, and the damage he's doing with uh, Nicolas Fury, it's pretty similar with Cyclops, because now I'm missing SCDP of Insight, as I told you, but, uh, yeah, you know what, if you can skip three characters with this boy here, I'm playing bad, I'm losing some procs, I'm losing some, you can see here, I lost the tier 3. It's sloppy runs. I did record the runs like one shot, everything. I didn't play like one billion times to figure out perfect runs or something. I just figure out the rotation. For this one, it was the uh, harder. Because you can see, you need to let your third skill place and have it as a filler every single time. And you can see, I'm already 8 million and I'm in the middle of the fight. If you play proper and you're good on that, more than me you can do 12 million for sure and you have similar account with me right and so if you get this character guys to tier 4 you can go for blast villain male blast and free day and i know loki is uh, like a character everyone got but you can you you could skip him if you just started and you want to catch up with abx meta this guy helps you a lot because you're replacing Loki, you're replacing Mephisto and Doctor Strange in the same time. You could take all the audience blessing for this character and put him in your Iron Man and having a perfect character doing everything just better from the others in ABX for three days or four days, depending on the week. Four days on, uh, you know, Iron Man, Iron Man, swapping uniform, Iron Man, Iron Man. <laughs> It's, it's so funny and it's so cool and when I figured it out, I was like, 
oh my god, I need to tell that to the boys, you know? Yeah, I have a lot of new players, you know, in uh, my channel. And you guys, you know, if you were thinking about Moon Knight, yes, cool, he's pretty much doing the same, but you can't do that with ABX. You can't do that with other content, and you need specific build to be successful that good as Iron Man. I'm gonna show you more content and we're gonna go through squad battle and wild boss, world boss legend but before that we're going for GBR and you can see here 11 point uh, yeah 11.24 without insight you can check my account I have no insight on Colson or Fury so that means it could be even better so let's go to the next one and the next one gonna be dbr uh, i mean i'm not i'm not sure if i have to let it you know play until the end but uh, you you know you pretty much know when you're seeing the damage and you're seeing the number back there the timing let's say two minutes let's see how how fast i'm gonna do the two minute clear you know it's not fair letting it play uh, the full one, I feel like it's more than two minutes, I can't really remember. And you can see, he is a blast type, I don't have an advantage, he's not combat type. So I'm able to reach 32 bar in like 30 seconds. That's really fast, but it's not like way faster than the others. But let's see what's gonna happen after I'm gonna get the buff for 30%, uh, you know, less HP like now. Let's see this tier 3, you can see it's all the bars went away, and yes, it's so juicy when you're getting the shield from the 7th uh, skill and the guy drops you a fire in the face, you can see I was pretty unlucky here, I had myself into the mindless one zone, and I was trying not to, to use my good skills, you know? And when I went in, there were fires going on, so I used the shield, I took some damage from the fires, and I was having... Oh, I had my fifth skill interrupted there, but you can see the third skill did some juicy damage. I took some damage now. Yeah, I, w I was having trouble doing my rotation proper, I, didn't e I haven't even done a proper rotation at the moment, guys. Here I took the shield with the fire and after I did accumulate a lot. You see a tier 3 off proc went like 2 bars out of nowhere. 2 minutes left and we're already in 26 bar. And as you can see I'm pretty much the only one who is doing... It's a random team. I just went into a random team and I, got, I said, you know, I'm gonna test myself. With not, you know, friend list or alliance. And yes, I, ha I was having trouble doing my rotation, but you can see, when I was successfully doing the thing I had to do, I was having some really good results. And you can see the rotation here, it's pretty much different. Uh, I'm, doing, I'm doing 3 cancel, 4 cancel, 5, not the ABX rotation. Uh, there is a difference in between. And yes, let's see here. My Ironman, look at this. Let's see the proper rotation. Here is a proper rotation. And we started 19 bar. So yes, a proper rotation, it's like 4 bars every single time. Look at this. Okay. Okay. Okay, oh, pretty much I left all the run. Uh, so yes, you get it. Iron Man Tier 4 can destroy content like this. You don't really need to have him tier 4 to do that, I was showing you. Because, you know, for ABX, the tier 4 gives him like 1 million boost on both days. But for content like GBR, even without the tier 4, you could clear it like with 1 or 2 minutes less. And it's pretty much the same. But for ABX, 1 million points, if you're pushing it, it's a lot. Let's go for squad battle. And you can see here, guys. I am into the round 2, I'm having 25 left seconds and I'm having 3 lights. That's the way you should be every single time in squad battle guys. You should start the phase 3 
with three lights on and if you are not doing it and you don't know how to do it you are not a follower of the channel you know if you don't know how to do that drop down below in the comments your idea basically tell ask me how you should do that and if there is more than 10 people asking about it I'm gonna I'm gonna make another video for squad battle I've already do like two or three videos for squad battle so yes let me know if there is a lot of people want to see how you manage to do this and start the third round the round three full let me know down below in the comments so let's go through and yes here you're up after you're successfully doing that you want to save your tier 3 and your 3 cancel 5 cancel 5 cancel 4 until the boss comes and in the perfect the perfect thing to do is not even hitting the mobs but i'm trying to push the score a bit here that's why i'm doing you know some cheeky damage you don't want to enable ctp of rage before the boss come like i do but uh, even with this, uh, my you know, my rage is up already, so I'm gonna miss some damage. But let me show you what I'm able to pull out in squad battle on free day, of course. You pretty much want to collect the first, uh, the first lights every single time, you know, between the rotation. And you can see I'm already that far on the lights where I can skip, you know, from now on I can skip, I can stay, stand still doing DPS with the maximum buff and the maximum buff is with these things here and I'm lighting all the lights, I'm standing still, I'm taking damage to boost my, my accumulation on the shield and you can see we're in the first phase and I already have done 7 million I know it's disgusting but it is what it is guys uh, you're gonna see even more here so yes be ready <laughs> the number gonna be more juicy and just to let you know guys the top score i was used to do was 10.3 10.4 uh, with some lunas with some characters and here i'm missing ctp of insight also right i don't have insight here i'm just using the colson team up here i'm lacking some uh, insights to put in characters that i'm not using only for abx because I want all my characters in ABX having an insight, the support, you know. So I'm not spending anywhere else. And I have unequipped uh, from Nicolas Fury, who totally deserves one. And here you can see I managed to end up having uh, not any protective light. I couldn't save myself some. There's no co op skill. With the co op skill, okay, I'm not saying anything. If you want to learn, drop down below in the comments your name and tell me you know what i want a squad battle video bro i don't know how to do it and you can see it's pretty much 10.8 yeah 10.8 10.8 for my boy iron man with that build and now guys let's go to the content that he is most useful and that's world boss legend yeah he's totally busted for world boss legend look what i'm able to do for world boss legend now stage 29 with his villain uniform look at this guys i had already pressed the rotation but pretty much it's three cancel five cancel four and proking every single time on your fourth skill or on your tier three you want to use your fifth skill before the skill you want to damage like the fourth skill on your tier three or else you're losing a lot of damage and look at this i'm taking advantage of the okay cutscene here yeah i missed some damage there if he didn't went into uh cutscene i could go him like five to six bars down you know it's i'm only 40 seconds into the next stage and he got like 15 bars left look at this tier three yeah I missed some damage there, but still, and you can see, you can rush through this, you don't need, really need to wait, okay, here he had, he was doing that, if he wasn't doing that, I could be able to push him without using this face here, but you, you can see, it's one minute in the stage, and we're in the last, in the very last phase, so you can imagine about 100 second challenge, right? 
and World Boss Legend Ultron stage 29 was one stage I wasn't able to clear before we get him as a level 80. I was able to do uh, to clear him as a level 80, but with you know level 80 tier 3, but with tier 4, I'm doing like with sloppy rotations this good 100 second challenge check so now let's go to the next world boss the previous was stage 29 this one it's stage 39 same rotation same uniform same thing it's but this time it's against now king in black king of symbiotes and yeah you shouldn't you shouldn't use your rotation before he push you back but yes, I'm doing just for getting the tier 3 faster and tier 4 faster. You know, you want to spam your skills as more as you can because you are getting the accumulation from the shield. It's it's a lot of it's a lot of more you know, you're doing way more than previously. Here there's some hurricanes breaking my shield, so giving me accumulation. And even with skills like the third skill. And here I didn't want to spend my tier 3 as you can see and did like 3 cancel 4 just to push him. And on this one you would prefer having the shield or the 7 skill open so he jumped into your face and you did accumulate a lot of damage. You can see there I accumulate tons of damage. My 7 skill was enabled when he came into my head jumping and I did a tier 3 and pushed him all the face through. That's the way, that's the, the perfect way to do it with him, bro. He totally, he totally getting smashed by null skills. And after he is giving back with his shield, you know. Look at this, look at this, guys. <laughs> this is Bart, uh, Bart's melting. My top stage of uh, null I've ever done, it's 49. I'm struggling stage 50 and I can't do it. So I'm giving you that as an info. To understand the value of having a character right now doing the 100 second challenge here as you can see without even letting Thor jump into Null. He, I was just trying to push it and he did it so good. Stage 39, 100 sec second check. Let's go to the last challenges and this one was stage 49 of uh, Mephisto. And I wanted to do it on time. I was clearing it with him as a tier 3. But I wasn't able to do the 100 seconds. You know, stage 49. 100 second challenge. It's tough. You saw there I was struggling for stage 29. And for stage 39. 29 Ultron and 39 Null. Let's see how I could go and perform here. With uh, my with my Iron Man as a tier 4 instead of tier 3. Here I didn't I, I didn't swap yet Jane into my main striker and I had Sentry. He's doing decent damage, but I feel like uh, Jane doing more for World Boss Legend and even more for World Boss Legend, guys. Uh, it's uh, this guy here, Ancient One, without even uniform. He is giving a debuff to the boss uh, where you could get advantage on it. You have to go and take it. There is a lot of combinations you could do with his uh, striker ability. You could take advantage of a lot of abilities of the characters you don't even know. If you go and search, there is a lot of stuff you could do, you know. Uh, with my own research, you know, Wanda was one uh, worth totally. And you can see here, I am in the last phase. 3 minutes and 40 seconds left. And I was like here, no, 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 I don't want him to charge me. I want to push that. And I was trying to press the skills, but I was stunned. And stunned again. And I pressed, I throw a tier 3 there, but the tier 3 missed. I was desperate, as you can see. But still, if, even with this stupid stuff I was doing, I was able to clear. You can see, I took the challenge there. I was missing that. I was missing the challenge in stage 29 of... Um, Ultron also so guys in overall so guys in overall I feel like Iron Man it's like top choice to tier for him if you're struggling like me having the tier 4 materials you know I'm not buying any so yes if you're just farming them you know uh, and you and you have less than this 
you know, and you have like 6,000 of carbonadium, go for Ironman, guys. I feel like he is top choice at the moment. And he got, uh, with the CDP of Rage, I was able to do have these results. You have to consider what, with Mighty Destruction, you're doing even more for World Boss Legend. But at the moment, I feel like I want to keep him a CTP of Rage and be able to do all this content with the same, you know, having a lot of value on any content and use him for autoplay mode, dispatch mission, everything, because with the Rage, everything looks cooler with Iron Man. Guys, I hope I make up. You have to consider basically before I end up the video, I want to tell you and remind you that you have to consider that I have these cards. I have these stats on the cards. And if you want to perform the same or better, you have to have at least the same or better with my. Or perhaps you have some less and you're a better player. You know how it goes. But don't believe that you're gonna do that the same thing with zero peers or without. Ignore defense 50% or cooldown 50%. You know, it's something that I'm doing because I have this stacked up Ironman 81,000 energy attack. So, yes, that was it. Mr. Tony Stark smash it. It's one guy for all the content. And yeah, I hope you enjoy it. I hope I make you smile. I hope I make you. What this Ironman can do? What? Because it's true. He's doing everything, guys. He's doing everything. Build Iron Man. No. Take your own decisions, guys. Bye-bye to everyone.